Este acts as was all long transfer plan as he set to move to Manchester United this summer and also Manchester United leader Thomas Zilea scores a prison from takeover as he is set to move to another club. So Welcome to Football Ingo. See you get the daily news match analysis and latest updates about my United. So if you are new to the channel, please do the subscribe, like this video, leave a comment below and watch this video to the end. So today's news, we are actually talking about Ten Ags Rasmus Hodgelon transfer plan. So he is an Atlanta player, a very young star, 20 years old, as he's doing well this season. As Ten Ags wants him as a backup striker. For next season, that we will not see that Tiago will see as a backup tracker for next season, as you're gonna feel that and help the other tracker, maybe Al Kane, because Simon, we don't know who the tracker exam wants to sign, and that means Victor Simon that was saucy with my United wants Victor Simon or Al Kane this summer, so either from that two and different tracker also linked to German United that multiple tracker but Manchester United coach exams wants as much as long at his backup tracker as the transfer plan is actually going where as my United need to land their transfer plan so Atlanta for the as much as long as joined a game on my United striker shortlist it could be available for around 40 million pounds. My United could sign two striker this summer. Tiaz wants to send an ally striker with a can top in the wanted list and up an upcoming striker like Asmos. Odlon so every time actually wants this awesome little 20 years old Atlanta forward like he's actually doing well this season have dropped some amount of goals and he's doing well as my United needs this awesome player next season as he's in that transfer target like Rashmus Oslo is a is brilliant he's doing well so Masha United are targeting Atlanta striker Rashmus Oslo but they will struggle to secure a deal below 60 million pounds United are indeed for him the club will not be encouraged to make an opening offer of 40 million pounds an amount that have been floating in the UK media so my United might get him maybe Atlanta put an awesome price last of 60 million pounds and I don't think my United can afford doubt except if the Glazers made that decision of the new owner soon and quickly as every time they actually need of that as we need an awesome owner to give him that big cash that big cash drop each transfer and I think it's gonna be the Qatari billionaire because he has the big cash to help my United in the transfer with the Arash first old loan as much old loan is my United just listed in my United list as he's also leading with this season and gonna have be a backup striker for my United next season. That's my also link with my United in general and now that you ask I will not hide the fact that I am a youth in my United fans so personally his playing for them would be one of the biggest things for me. So that was what he said when an interviewer asked him about his being linked to my United. He said he loved my United for me. Should I do that? Would that, want, that would be the biggest dream in his career to play for Master United. All the players just want to be on my United. have different players. So that's my old love. is actually a good backup striker for next season. So, Leave it in the comment section guys if you think of the awesome York style like should it be should it be my United backup check and next season just drop it down in the comment section guys and I will see that let's have a great discussion so guys my autumn is actually linked to join my United next season and he's an awesome young star 20 years old he dropped me some amount of goals that he's actually doing when that's a lot of this is and also Thomas the last course is my United be the third bidder who which no sources are actually talking about but he actually dropped and we draw from the takeover as he has the job and I think he can't compete with Sajin Wafet or even the Katai Billion and Shang Gazem B Ahmed Atani. Like I don't think I can compete with them. That's the reason he dropped that off the takeover of Manchester United as he, he ended to go to another club 
and drop his bid in another club like there are different clubs so for him to drop his bid like Tottenham or Sport and even West Ham and different other clubs but they have actually dropped that from Manchester United that we don't want to be the owner of my United have dropped his bid and Iglesias only focusing on Shangazim and Sajim Raflet for my United take over so Tom Mozilla got something and offer to buy my United that would have seen fans on 50% but after rejoining interest the Finn has revealed each group are now looking at other club so he is the United bidder that actually said the my United fans gonna contribute for him and his company like they're gonna drop 50 percent while the United fans will drop 50 percent so you have 50 percent fans ownership like that's a great one like that's one of the funniest things I've seen like he's gonna owe 50 percent why the fans are gonna owe 50 percent but I don't think he can compete with Sajim Mathis or over the category in Ashangazim so he has actually so dropped his bid that he has withdrawn from his bid and he withdrawn from the takeover as the Glazers now focus on and are still making a decision between Sajim Mathis the category billionaire and Sajim Mafet has still yet to make that decision. The Lazers family has yet to make that decision between Sajim Mafet or the Qatari building at Shangazi. So, John Mozilla scores the My United bid that actually reached one from takeover. I don't want to own My United, and I don't think his bid is enough. Like, I want the United fans to contribute as you're gonna have a 50% ownership while the United fans own 50%. Like, that would be great. Like, United fans actually contributing. For my United, so drop the comment section, guys. Your first thing of this my United be that as you have region from each takeover of my United. Just drop the comment section, guys. Let's have a great discussion. So, Tom Mozilla scores have dropped his bid as he can't compete with Sajim Mafet or the Katai Billion and Shangazin B. Ahmed Altani as he have dropped some the bid and gonna face another club. So, so Mozilla Scott has something they did to buy my United, but the condition is, is that each company will finance half of the money while United fans will finance the other half by contributing about three dollar each. So I've said this before, like he wants the United fans to contribute three dollar each. That means that means each company is gonna drop fifty percent off the takeover like of the bid that we're gonna submit and now but recently I've been reporting that he has actually dropped from the takeover he has to join the bid and gonna face other club I pray he gets on that club so just wishing just wishing a great one I had like so thanks for watching the guys please do the subscribe like the video leave a comment below and what Drop your comments of what you think of the awesome video, guys. The Mozilla Scots can't compete with Sajim Maflet or the British or the Qatar Billionaire Shangazin B. Ahmed Atan and have finally dropped and we draw from the takeover. The Glazers are seen in the middle to make that decision between Sajim Maflet or Shangazin. So, don't leave that conversation, guys. Who do you think should be the national of my United? So, some of Rasmus, whose loan is. Might be my United backup striker next season if my United can land a clinical striker like Victor Sime or Harry Kane. But I don't think Victor Sime is off in the market anymore. But Harry Kane is also up and I think gonna join my United because I've been different. You saw saying uh, reporting the same about Harry Kane. But as most Woodland is actually a great backup choice for a return transfer plan. So Thomas last course bid couldn't buy Manchester United and they have actually withdrawn from the takeover of my United. So thanks for watching it guys. We do have the subscribe smash that subscribe button. Thanks for watching this video. Thanks for clicking this video. So yes we get the daily news match night and latest of the table my United. The ladies are still here to make that decision between Sajim Mafet and the Katai Billionaire. Shan Gazin be Ahmed Tatani. So bye fellow devils. Bye guys. Smash that subscribe button. Like the video. Share the video and drop your comment of your opinion about the video guys. Bye fellow devils. Bye guys.